The women always think they know everything. What? Genetics. Because we do. Well, correct me if I'm wrong, but my husband and my brother-in-law were making plans for my birthday. Wow. Schneller. Ding, ding, ding. Right How did you know? Wait, can you do me a favor? Yeah. Please, can you bring in Maxie? She wants to do this ginormous event, and I want ten people, and I'm serious about that. You seem to be under the false impression that Maxie actually listens to what I say. Yeah, well, hopefully she listened to me. I just don't, you know, I don't want a big deal made out of that. And Okay, maybe a little bit of a big deal. So why don't you get back to what you guys were talking about, and I hope it's fabulous. Okay. Thanks for covering. Yeah, well, I know she thinks that I've been, well, thinking about Lisa, but she just doesn't know to what extent. It's no problem. Don't worry about it. That's what brothers used to do, right? They cover for each other. Support each other. Which is why I paged you. I've been thinking about the Brockman case, and um, I think you should take it. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. Come again? What did you say? Brockman, I didn't quite catch Brain tumor that. 1026. He's a perfect candidate for your trial. Case is yours. What's ringing this on? Well, you want to test your, your trial, don't you? And he's a perfect candidate for that. Not that he has a chance of surviving, but it's an opportunity. Oh, okay. That's it. You don't want Brockman dying because that's bad for your stats, so why not appear magnanimous and hand him over to your brother? That way he can die on my watch and, you know, doesn't count against you. Know, you know, it doesn't matter what I say, does it? You always think I have an ulterior motive. Well, every time I look for it, I'm never disappointed. Screw you. Hey, hey, did we not just do this? Diggy, you weren't talking about my birthday. I'm out of here. Where are you going? I got something to do. Yeah. 